Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to build the best possible team in all of Madden 21 Ultimate Team. Now, previously, I've shown you guys how to build a 50 of 50 Chiefs theme team and a 50 of 50 Washington theme team. But today, we have a 50 of 50 Las Vegas Raiders theme team. First off, why get a Raiders theme team? Well, uh, every single Raider in the roster will get all of these attribute boosts. And the main thing we care about is plus two speed. Speed is king in Madden. It has been king for the, I don't know how many years I've played since Madden 17, very seriously. It's been king every single year since then, and it probably will be king moving forward speed is very important so keep in mind that every single raider is going to be plus four speed because they get plus two from sprinters so every single player in the whole lineup is gonna have plus two speed that's because they have 40 plus sprinters guys a lot of you guys send me your lineups and how to improve them go out and get sprinter it's the very first thing get to 40 sprinters you cannot replace speed but then every single raider which is a lot of them are all gonna get plus for these attributes plus two speed the most important one and it's just it's critical if you want to have the best team in mutt you have to be running a 50 of 50 theme team right now now look up in the top right corner it says 97 overall what we do is we ignore that we always ignore that the raiders happen to have a very high overall theme team but for the most part it's not important um for instance marcel reese this dude will never play for me he counts towards my team overall right now i have henry ruggs basically never plays for me he counts my towards my team overall even more importantly i have richard seymour Leroy glover warren sapp crucial parts of the lineup especially the right Glover he's a crucial part of building a theme team but he will never ever play for me now thankfully these are guys that are high overall but they'd never play for me so like for Richard Seymour I could have just a 60 overall there and it would do the exact same thing so just don't look at overall it's super overrated there are times where I have eight DBs on the field look how many count towards my overall five like uh, on offense, I only run two wide receivers. I run two halfbacks. Like, it, it's just, do not look at overall, okay? It pisses me off when people say, like, this theme team's this overall. I don't care. I care about what players get what boost. I want the best possible 11 guys on my offense and on my defense. And then, you know, having some flexibility with backups. Like, for instance, with the Raiders, it's nice to have Jerry Rice and Henry Ruggs as my backup wide receivers. And yes, they're my backups, okay? Because in my specialists, I'm hiding Terry McLaurin, okay? One of my favorite receivers in the game. He should be on every single team. But as you're looking at this team, you're probably wondering, like, hey, Throne, there are a lot of players that aren't Raiders on this theme team. How did you get to 50 Raiders on this team and that is what i'm going to be showing you guys today is how to build a 50 50 raiders theme team to perfection which by the way i use more non raiders than i use raiders just fyi so there's a lot of flexibility with having a 50 50 raiders theme team particularly and a, lo a lot for other ones so starting off guys uh if you go click a player let's click jerry rice right here it's going to say in the top right it's going to say players 55 of 55. that means we can have 55 unique players in our lineup 55 that is the the very max so many times i've had like a slot open i've had like a fullback slot open or something like that or fullback number two people have been like throne you don't have a player in that spot you're missing no i've always had 55 players in my lineup i cannot put any more and right now i have the full 55. you need to have the full 55. you want to maximize your team now if we go again look we're building a 50 raiders theme team so that would mean, you know, intuitively, that we would only have five non-Raiders. That's not true. There are many ways to open up free spots in your lineup, and today I'm gonna show you how. The most important one is your team captain. I use Leroy Glover. If I go check out Leroy Glover right now, I have him fully maxed out. He gets one, two, three, four, five Raiders. So that gives me four extra spots. So like I said, we had five before. Now we have nine by having a max Leroy Glover with five Raider spots. You can do that for any team with Leroy Glover. You can do it for any team with all the other team captains. But I think you get them. I think Leroy Glover is the best one. Okay. Just, just, I've just heard that. I'm not certain why. Also, every single team has, I think it's a team diamond is what it's called. Anyway, the Raiders is Rich Gannon. So I just have him barely powered up. He gets times three Raiders chem. So that's going to open up two more slots for Raiders in this team. Now we have, what, 11 spots open? I hope so. So how do we get to the final 15? If we go to team strategy, you get your stadium, your coach, and both uniforms in your team strategy. Again, you can still use, you know, different uniforms and different coach for your visuals. I wish they could let us pick a stadium. But um, you get these four also. So that opens us up to 15 non-Raider positions in this entire lineup lineup and it gives you so much flexibility guys i'm gonna show you how i spend those 15 non-raider positions right now first off i have no raiders o linemen so that's five i just spend five non-raiders on o linemen i wanted the best o line sheds are crazy in mutt right now especially if you pass from under center i love having the best o line so i have 
uh, an entire team of the year offensive line. That's five right there. Uh, one of my most important positions, Deshaun Watson is a non-raider that I use. That is six right there. And I'm actually going to go to my specialist next. I wanted to show Terry McLaurin. He is my number one or number two receiver. You know, he's not showing up on my offensive screen, but I have Terry McLaurin hiding back here. That is my seventh. If we look at the defense, we're going to start seeing a lot of guys. We have Sean Taylor. That's eight. Lawrence Taylor. That's nine. We have Jamal Adams. That's 10. Deion Sanders. That's 11. Oh, shoot. I missed Michael Strahan. That's 12. And if we continue back to our specialists, we have a couple more. We have uh, Isaiah Simmons hiding back here. And we have Montez Sweat. That's 14. And then for special teams, they do get Sebastian Janikowski, who's awesome. But I wanted to have the best possible kicker. The team is already so good. Um, I didn't think I needed any backups to other spots. So I decided to go with the best possible kicker, Jason Sanders. Uh, he's 96 overall. He's like a billion kick power. This guy can kick the ball from freaking the midfield. This guy is the best. And that's how I'm spending my 15 non-Raiders. So those guys are only going to get plus two speed. The Raiders, however, are going to get plus four. So for instance, if we come back, we look at Darren Waller, one of the biggest upgrades that you get by a 50-50 Raiders theme team. You get a 97 speed Darren Waller. This guy is a wide receiver playing, uh, playing tight end and he can air truck. He's one of the best cards in the entire game. And it's, he's, he's literally probably a top three card in the game, actually. This card is incredible. I love this Darren Waller card. Honestly, he's one of the biggest reasons for having a Raiders theme team. Now, we get Darren Waller. We also get a 90, 99 speed Moss. We get a 98 speed Jerry Rice. We get a 99 speed Henry Ruggs. We get a 99 speed Bo Jackson. We have, I think, a 95 speed Marcel Reese. He's really good. What is he? 96 speed. And he's just my random fullback. That's just the guy I have who you know returns my kick when people kick to the up man. Like, he can actually take a kick to the crib he's 96 speed oh i also have a i think a 99 speed barry sanders chilling back here he's 99 right yeah he's 99 speed because barry sanders gets every single team cam so i have barry sanders at my backup halfback and if we go look at the defense this is where things get crazy so dion is already 99 speed but with the raiders we get 99 speed rod woodson we get 99 speed eric allen we get 98 speed d'angelo hall I think 97 or 98. What's Charles Woodson? 98? 98 speed Charles Woodson. My Jamal Adams is already 98 speed. My Isaiah Simmons, my other safety is already 97. Sean Taylor's at 96, which is fine. I do miss 98 speed Sean Taylor from the Washington deep team. But you get so many fast players with this lineup. It's just crazy. This team is just absolutely stacked. And you have so much depth. Like I mentioned, I have four wide receivers. So I have a, I have 99 speed Terry McLaurin uh, hiding in my specialist because he just gets to 99 speed without being on a theme team. Having that type of depth in Mutt is so nice. We have a 50 Raiders theme team and we basically sacrifice nothing for this entire team. I, I don't know what I would want extra on this team. I really don't need any more backups. I don't need any more DBs. I have everything. I have the best kicker possible. I have everything. <laughs> Even the best O-line. I have the best O-line on a theme team. This Raiders theme team is cracked. A lot of you guys ask me about my abilities, so I will show you guys. On offense right now, currently, I'm using Deshaun Watson with Hot Rob Master and Gunslinger. This is subject to change, but that's what I'm using right now. That's, you know, six AP total. I'm using two post-ups on my guards. On Quentin Nelson and Brandon Scherf, I have a uh, post-up, which is one AP each. That's two more. And I use four AP on Playmaker on Terry McLaurin. That's kind of like a flex four AP. I can spend that however I want. Sometimes I like route tech on Darren Waller. Uh, you know, it just, it depends what I'm feeling uh, on, on that day. But right now I like Playmaker. Terry McLaurin's a 99 speed, you know, Playmaker wide receiver. I think Playmaker's so good. Those are, th th but that is how I'm sp spending this 12 AP. And man, I can't speak, dude. This is, <laughs> I'm tired. Then on defense, how I'm spending my AP. This is, you know, a little bit less critical. So on Lawrence Taylor, Khalil Mack, and where is Michael Strahan? I am spending double or nothing or two AP on double or nothing for each of them. So that's six AP. And I have Acrobat on Deion Sanders, Rod Woodson, and Eric Allen, and D'Angelo Hall. It's one AP for corners. So those four corners have it. That's four more. Uh, and then we have two more AP left. I have Midzone KO on Sean Taylor and D'Angelo Hall. Uh, Midzone KO is one AP on zone archetypes. And those are my only two zone archetypes that I have on my team. But yeah, no, this team is just absolutely stacked. Those are my abilities on both sides of the ball. Those are the guys that I have. Guys, man. Ah. I don't think you can ask for a better team in this. Go out and build your 50 of 50 Raiders theme team now if you want to be at an advantage or if you just want to be like everybody else, you know, but hey, I just want the best team possible. That's that's the way I play Madden. Before we get into the game, I wanted to say I'm using the 49ers offense and Giants defense. My ebooks are on hotrod.tips. They're going to be linked in the description. You know, full offensive and defensive schemes. Exactly how I play Madden. If you want to know how to play Madden, that's the place to be, okay? If you want to know how to play it like me, that's the place to be. I highly recommend you guys go check it out. Oof, what an intro. These intros get, they get hectic when we 
we do these theme teams. So I want to show you guys exactly what I have in my lineup, exactly how you can build your lineup to mimic my sort of team. Because I think this is the best team in all of Madden 21 Ultimate Team. And yeah, let's get into the gameplay. I got a game instantly at 6.44 a.m. That's actually terrifying. Guys, that is terrifying. I know I just matched up with, an, with a really good player. This is going to be a good game, though. I'm down to get sweaty. FBI, open up! I mean, look at my top three. Look at how sexy my top three is. Deshaun Watson with two 99 speed receivers. It's beautiful. And keep in mind, I have a backup 98 speed receiver and then a backup 99 speed receiver. And then I think Cordell Patterson's even 97. So I have just so much depth uh, in this Raiders team. Heck, you might as well just say I have another 97 receiver, except he's able to play tight end, Darren Waller. This team is incredible. And I talked about Marcel Reese, 96 speed and can air truck. I can just start air truck and air truck, air truck, air truck. This guy has so much speed on those returns. I absolutely love having him at that position. Now, ball carrier conservative, let's get after it. When you have a 50 of 50 theme team, you got to sub a few people. You know, you can't start him at the exact spot. So I just sub in Barry Sanders there, sub in Terry McLaurin there, and then we roll. All right. Uh, by the way, I'm betting money right now. Uh, $100 to anyone who wants lock the bet that he comes out in 335 normal and audibles down to 335 wide that is guaranteed to happen because i know i'm playing a sweat that is how he's going to defend strong close so if anyone wants to lose money lock the bet please i need the money after <laughs> after amc actually by the time you guys are seeing this video hopefully amc went up and hopefully i made money but right now i'm down so it is what it is man i made money on dogecoin i'm not recommending how you guys invest by the way i'm not a trained professional i'm just saying stuff i'm just saying what i did ah he didn't come out in normal he's just coming out right in three through five wide it's still gonna be trouble oh hold up hold up hold up what's going on he's moving the safety down little stop and go with barry sanders gonna pick up like six okay okay i didn't do my protection there i was a little bit scared i can't lie but you know we're still able to pick up six and somehow he wasn't able to get that user rush in which is a little odd that was a little odd snap the ball Okay, well, it's not wide open, though. Wide open. That curl flat was not getting out there. He did double Mabel me right there. I, I respect the play call, but it's it's Deion Jones trying to play deep. It's Deion Jones, and he's in a curl flat. They don't get they don't, they don't get to the sideline very well anyway. I've got playmaker on Terry McLaurin. 99 speed wide receiver. Let's just playmaker him. Let's go crazy. Let's go crazy. I'm definitely an un, un, unnecessary playmaker. I could just throw the regular in route right there, but I love playmakering them. I like using or making use of the, the four AP that I'm spending. 18 yard line. This is a tough yard line to score, man. This is a tough yard line to score. I'm going to quick hike and just hope that he doesn't user rush me. Don't user rush me. Get over here. I'm no huddling. I'm no huddling. I'm no huddling. No huddle. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Terry McLaurin on an in route. I can playmaker him if I want. I think I got the user rush picked up right now. No user rushing. No user rushing. It's unfair. Throw the ball to the flat. Deshaun Watson. Does he have the worst release in the game? Oh my gosh. I'm just trying to throw to the flat. Well, I've got a third and 22 now. I'm actually screwed. There's no way I convert this. I have to go crazy with the playmaker or something. So I'm just going to put Terry McLaurin on a slant like this. Whatever. I've really got no choice. I, I don't have a choice. It's probably going to blitz everybody. Yeah. 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 I actually might go for this now. No. Do I go for this? Do I go for this? I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. It's a YouTube video. It's a YouTube video. It's a YouTube video. Terrible play call. Absolutely terrible play call. Under pressure and accurate. Does that end up being a first down if this dude, Deshaun Watson, throws it accurately? Can we please make a tackle here? He's going to be gone. Thank God. Thank God. Thank God. The Deshaun Watson, I, who's on my best team in, in all of Ultimate Team, is having a rough day. I uh, didn't get the ball off to the flat because the corner came in hot. There gets the ball off, but just overthrows it. It's actually, it was probably in coverage regardless, but still, it's just, blah, 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 blah. I hate you, Deshaun. I hate every quarterback, though. I actually, I do hate every quarterback. I hate him. I hate him, man. I hate him with passion. Just only sending two. Just only sending two. Just only sending two. That's got to be played. That's got to be my rock. I have a cloud there. I really got to go down to a 15-yard cloud? Oh, please don't let him throw over it. Please do not let him throw over it. Please don't motion over Dion. Actually, don't motion over anybody. I'm screwed if he does. Because I touched Dion. I touched Dion. Don't motion. Yes, yes. Motion to pick up the blitz. Yes, do that, please. Watch out for a curl. He's got this post here. Nope. Isaiah. Isaiah. You're six foot five. Nine inch penis. Get up. That's a rough one. That That's a rough way to start the game. Okay. Down seven, nothing. Woohoo. Yeah. Woo. It's fine though. It's fine. You know, we had a we had a great methodical drive downfield. We're gonna be we're gonna be fine, dude. I'm not doubting myself right now at all. Psych. Deshaun, what the f is happening? You f idiot! Holy shit, you suck!
Gotta call timeout. My whole team's tired. Jeez. Oh my gosh. This dude is ass. Jeez. Oh, you got a ball off to the flat, and Barry Sanders actually racked it this time. Nice. Congratulations. Oh my goodness. And before we get into the rest of the gameplay, I wanted to give a huge shout out to the sponsor of this video, Felix Gray. If you somehow aren't familiar with Felix Gray, they've sponsored me in the past and they make this pair of blue light filtering glasses that I have on right now. These are actually non-prescription. They're the black Kepler pair. And they sent me them a few months back and I really haven't taken them off since. Now, blue light filtering glasses are everywhere. They overpromise and underdeliver. Now, screens produce most blue light at a certain point in the spectrum, around 455 nanometers. And most clear blue light lenses filter only about two to 3% of this light. Felix Gray, on the other hand, filters filters 15 times more. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I am almost always in front of screens, whether it be on my phone, if I'm streaming or recording, or if I'm even just gaming for fun, I'm always in front of screens. And ever since Felix Gray sent me this pair, I'm sure you guys have seen me with them on before. I always wear them in front of screens and I've really noticed that they relieve the strain on my eyes. Now, Felix Gray has a few options. I mentioned mine are non-prescription, but you can get them in prescription as well. Now, their original optical lenses relieve most eye strain symptoms from daily screen time, but they also have more advanced sleep glasses that relieve serious daily eye strain and were especially designed for late night screen time to improve your sleep. Now, their blue light glasses come standard at $95, but you can add a prescription at checkout out, brings them up to 145 and if you don't love their glasses within the first 30 days their in-house customer care team will take care of exchanges and returns no hassle no questions asked so go check out felix gray and get your own pair i've linked them in the description below i promise you guys you won't regret it i absolutely love their products thank you so much to felix gray for sponsoring this video and let's get right back into it it's a little bit scary i don't think this is gonna work but i'm gonna try it Kill i just blocked six, seven i just blocked seven I'm streaking X. I'm streaking X. X is going to be open. He's going to let me throw X. Rough start to the game for TT, man. Rough start. Rough start. Ugh. Oh, boy. Nice, man. Nice. This is awesome. Throw another pick. Throw another pick, you idiot. Throw another pick, you idiot. Please. He's good. Like, I know he's good. I know he's good. Let me talk trash, though. Let me talk trash. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I can move the ball. It's just a matter of guessing right. By the way, he threw a pick, for the record. This guy threw a pick. So, on a touchdown? Literally threw it right to Isaiah Simmons. Yo, in Madden 21 with the lurks? They can get up, man. Crack him. Good tackle, Jamal, but that is sad. That is sad. I gave up those yards right there. It's getting dark out here, man. Come on. Don't burn me deep. 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 Good ball. Am I actually playing a guy who's like, oh, he's like pretty decent. We're going to need one stop out of half. This is going to be a rough half, but we're going to have to, we're going to have to scratch and claw to get back into the game, man. Officer arrested. E, 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 e. That's awesome. Good ball. Good ball, dude. Well done. Out of bounds. I need every single second, so I have to let this clock run down all the way to 15 before I can snap. Perfect. <sighs> Getting ends on here. Getting ends on here. I didn't mean to snap. I didn't mean to snap and and throw that. Oh my gosh, I've played. I've played bad too. It's a lot my fault as well. But he's probably gonna blow this up. Take it. He's gonna throw me the ball. That's the good news. He is gonna throw me the ball. How am I gonna make him throw me the ball? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But he's gonna throw me the ball. Make his Reese just fumble it. Make his Reese fumble it. It's just gotta be my defense here. It has to be. Wide open. 
wide open. He just lasers me first play. First play, I switch to a new defense. I get lasered. Try it! And he cut. Oh, and he catches it. He throws out a sack and catches it. Oh my gosh, dang it. Oh boy. I didn't throw out, I didn't sack him actually. Never mind. He didn't even throw out a sack. He just whiffed, or I just whiffed. Nice. It's got to be picked. Thank you. I have a 20-yard cloud. Now bring it out for seven. Dang it. I have a 20-yard cloud there. Like, how is that even remotely getting close to being over it? It's a 20-yard cloud on the 10-yard line. And it almost got over it. Okay, bounce. I'm in the game. I'm in the game. Come on. Come on. Let's go get points. Come on. Make his, make his Reese fumble this. Make it fair. Make him fumble it. Make Reese fumble it. Dang. He threw it to the spot I was covering. He just threw it to the spot I was covering. Nice read, dude. GG's, man. Gosh, you got away with everything. You got away with everything for a whole game. It's crazy. This is, that's miserable. That's so sad. I played bad, dude. I played bad. I played bad on offense. I did. Uh, I played bad on now. It's my fault. Mm, but I'm just a little frustrated. I feel like he caught some wild TDs. He played well. Like he still threw to open receivers when he needed to. Um, and hats off to him for passing at the end of the game. You know, he could have definitely clocked the game and instead he threw lasers like he did. He just he just did. Just hats off to him. Good game, man. Good game. Guys, I don't know. When are you guys seeing this? You're seeing it after the team of the year. I just lost back-to-back -back games recording videos. I just lost back-to-back -back games recording videos. That's what stinks. I recorded the team of the year one like an hour ago. Rough. GG, GG's to Emma Bob 5082. Oh my gosh. Did I play that? How bad did I play? Yeah, no, I played a lot worse than he did. He caught that ball with Bo. He caught this Isaiah Simmons one. No, that's not it. That was laser that I threw. That was actually hot as fuck. Um, he caught the one over Isaiah Simmons. Is it gonna be that one? That one. Um, yeah, I just couldn't get a turnover other than the one ball that I did pick him off in the red zone with. I did average 9.6 yards per play. Maybe I didn't play that poorly. I don't know. I feel like I did though. But hey, GG's to him. Thank you so much for watching the video. Guys, if you made it to the end, you enjoy what you see, consider hitting the subscribe button. It's a great way to support me and you can always unsub at any time. Oh, I'm sick. But now it's a, uh, I, I might record one throne two video and then it's, it's bye bye to this place. This is the last throne main video you're seeing at this place. That's crazy. That is absolutely crazy to me. Um, I, I can't believe it. I really can't, but shedding a freaking tear, man. I'm shedding a tear. I'm just tired. Actually, no, Throne's crying because he lost a Madden game. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.